uh, the association is an interface between academicians, professionals, and practitioners from various universities, business, industry, and government. The main function of IA is to promote the knowledge of accounting and related subjects in India and abroad. Further, it aims to undertake and encourage research in the field of accounting. Ever since its inception, the IA has served as an important form for raising the status of accounting, both as a discipline and as an important tool for managerial decision making. It also brings out a biannual research journal, Indian Journal of Accounting, to give wider publicity to research findings. The association also gives IA Young Research Award and IA Fellowship. Today, the Patiala branch of the association is glad to celebrate its birth anniversary by organizing a national webinar on the theme, Accounting in the Digital Era. Professor Manjeet Singh, President, Patiala branch of the association, has been made significant contribution to the association. Sir is presently professor and head, School of Applied Management, Punjabi University, Patiala. And he is also director, placement cell, entrepreneurship and skill development cell, coordinator, centralized admission cell, Punjabi University, Patiala. Sir has 27 years of teaching, research, and administrative experience. Sir published 110 research papers in reputed journals and four books. He guided 30 PhD students, including me. It's an honor for me. He also got a one opportunity to work with foreign universities. I request, sir, to welcome all the guests. Sir, please. Professor Manjeet, sir, sir, please. I think, sir, you are, your voice is not here. Sir, kindly unmute your mic, I think. Professor Manjeet, sir. Sir, you are not audible. Sir, kindly rejoin. I think there is some technical problem. Maybe the right mic is not selected. I think sir is rejoining. Joining, yeah. I think we should wait one or two minutes. Yeah, no issue. We are very happy that from the last previous year, we revived this association only due to the efforts of our Honorable Founder Vice Chancellor, Professor Karamji Singh Ji. Uh, and I think uh, if uh, definitely we will do more seminars, conferences, activities under his guidance. Actually, <laughs> he is supervising everything. And he, sir is very active, very energetic. And I think sometimes uh, we feel shy that sir is more younger than us if we see energy level. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I think Manji sir joined. Uh, till Professor Manji joined, let me say that uh, uh, that we are having today uh, this Patiala branch Indian conversation. And I must say that, uh, that Rohit is with us and Professor Majid Singh. He is, uh, uh, I mean, that uh, elderate scholar and otherwise also is having a good command over subject. So under the leadership of uh, Professor Majid Singh and uh, Rohit, and uh, of course, Professor Batra is with us also. He's old war house like me. <laughs> we will all together work together. And we have planned a series of, you know, activities. Uh, and uh, luckily, this is the first opportunity with us. And uh, I'm very happy that Professor Sorrell, who is a known figure in accounting institution and uh, particularly in accounting area also. And uh, another, Dr. Monica is with us that we have roped in because uh, 
although Australian people they are very busy in their own activities, but still I am grateful that uh, they have spared time uh, and they are with us. And uh, we are uh, we will be planning. We'll be in touch with the our uh, foreign. Um, I mean that person settled abroad, uh, accounting area, and we will try to uh, I mean forge some sort of alliances because uh, uh, Professor Sorrell and me also we went to American accounting session. Uh, conference also we participated and a lot of things we are i am still uh, in touch with the uh, professor sham sundar ji uh, he is he was a because he was a great name and um, rather he was interested at uh, in case opportunity comes he will come here also so sunil sir was we are uh, uh, even yesterday i had a meeting with the chandigarh branch also and we okay. will activate chandigarh branch maybe from next month that is we look forward to you are being there in patiala now we look forward entire punjab responsibility with you we will, we will definitely we will we will <laughs> keep on both in you people <laughs> yes, yes certainly rohit <laughs> sir majid has joined or not yeah am i yeah. am i up to now sir ah please kindly please. welcome all the guests yeah. professor majid sir uh, thank you thank you dr rohit uh, sorry for the technical glitch uh, It, uh, the uh, accounting association family on the foundation day of uh, indian accounting association so uh, my deep sense of regards to the past president and the present vice chancellor jagat guru nanak dev uh, state open university professor karamjeet singh uh, the former president of indian accounting association uh, professor g soral ji our guest of honor today dr uh, monica kansal uh, our very uh, esteemed uh, dean academic affairs and uh, one of the founding members of accounting association in the uh, punjab region professor g s batra and uh, the other dignitaries uh, uh, you know on, on this platform so uh, i congratulate uh, on this day and uh, uh, thanks to all of you that you have joined uh, us to uh, to com commemorate and to celebrate the foundation day of uh, indian accounting association well uh, professor karamjeet uh, uh, is a very proactive uh, member of uh, indian accounting association and it was uh, 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 his idea that uh, we should have some activity uh, on this day as well so we are thankful to you sir for uh, your encouragement for your motivation and uh, for your contribution Uh, to make indian accounting association as uh, one of the vibrant uh, association uh, in the academic uh, and it has played a very very important role in uh, transforming the the businesses uh, through an information system so i think again there is some technical issue sir voice is not audible uh professor manji sir your voice is not audible i think again there is some technical issue there is there are some problem network significant contribution made by accounting as a we praise the 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 kind of taken place and the kind of uh, uh, you know foundations we have uh, as a student of accounting we know that uh, initially most of the accounting systems 
were based uh, on the industrial revolution after industrial revolution, first industrial revolution where a lot of focus was on the manufacturing sector and most of the concepts most of the you know tools and techniques which were developed by accounting you know they were based on the uh, manufacturing uh, you know organization but with time uh, we realized that uh, you know the businesses are becoming more complex and uh, with the with the fifth phase of globalization which started from 80 On, uh, uh, you know, activity-based costing, then uh, uh, this, uh, uh, you know, target costing, Kaizen costing. So strategic cost management, you know, that became the, the next trend in the, in the earlier phase of uh, this fifth phase of globalization. And a lot many changes took place during that time as well. But now we are facing another challenge uh, as, uh, as accounting professionals, as accounting teachers, and that challenge is this uh, massive digitalization, which is taking place. We all know that, uh, you know, huge data is being uh, uh, accumulated these days. Data is considered as, uh, you know, next to uh, the gold because data is a gold mine. And a lot of information, a lot of data is being collected uh, these days. And it is also being said that uh, the amount of uh, data which has been collected during the last two years you know, that is more than the amount of data which have been recorded and accumulated during last two centuries. So uh, we can see that, uh, you know, in this uh, information age, uh, you know, the big data is playing a very, very important role in deciding uh, about the business models and in deciding about uh, the corporate strategies and all. And uh, no doubt, this big data is playing, you know, uh, you know, a very uh, wonderful role in whole of the process. But somehow, uh, accounting as an information system is uh, is facing uh, another challenge that how to find, you know, accounting relevant and uh, up to date in the in the present big data age. So keeping this thing in mind, that the kind of challenges which we are facing. Accounting fraternity to to adapt to these uh, you know changes and to stay relevant. So uh, uh, Professor Karamji, Dr. Batra, uh, Dr. Rohit, you know everybody was of the view that uh, you know this is the, the most appropriate uh, you know day to start uh, you know, the, the activities of Patella Chapter of Accounting Association that uh, you know, we should discuss uh, uh, these challenges. And we have the right uh, uh, you know, person here, uh, Dr. Monica Kansal. Uh, we are pr very proud that uh, she is uh, doing pretty well uh, in, the, in the foreign universities. Uh, we feel more proud because uh, uh, Dr. Monica happens to be the, the alumni of Punjabi University Patella. And um, I was fortunate that I attended uh, the Viva Ose exam of uh, Dr. Monica Kansal when uh, she was def defending her PhD. So the most appropriate, uh, you know, person, uh, Dr. Monica, uh, you know, kindly gave her consent to uh, to speak on this issue. So uh, you know, not taking much of the time. Uh, I, I hope that, uh, you know, we'll be having a, a wonderful uh, year ahead, wonderful time ahead. And uh, this activity uh, will be the, the stepping stone and the rolling stone for the activities of Indian Accounting Association. And I hope that our session is going to be very, very fruitful. So I'm grateful to all the uh, dignitaries, all the, uh, you know, the academicians uh, who have uh, uh, spared the time from the busy schedules to, uh, to celebrate the foundation of uh, Indian Accounting Association. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. So the knowledge views shared by you will help us to fill the digital knowledge gap. Your ideas have certainly prepared us to accept the challenges and adopted the changing digital environment. Thank you, sir. Now I take the privilege to invite Dr. Monica Kansal 
our guest of honor to share her views. Ma'am worked in School of Business and Law, Central Queensland University, Melbourne, Australia. She has contributed more than 20 such papers in high ranking journals. She is passionate about teaching innovation and has successfully used flipped classroom and innovative interactive tools like Socrative's video to enhance the student learning experience. Ma'am has received more than one lakh dollars grant in social innovations. She was awarded scholarship of learning and teaching 2018. She also received vice chancellor's awards for outstanding contributions to learning and teaching 2018. Ma'am, kindly share your knowledge with us. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, Dr. Rohit. Um, good afternoon, everyone. I hope you can, everyone can hear me. Is, is my voice okay? Yes, ma'am, audible. Yes, thank you. Um, first of all, my thanks to Professor Batra, who has been my PhD supervisor um, and my mentor throughout my um, academic career. Uh, so thanks to him for inviting me, for giving me this opportunity to talk of, for a few minutes in this, um, in this webinar. Um, I'm really indeed humbled as well as honored to be a speaker here. Um, so uh, my greetings to uh, dignitaries on the stage, Dr. Sorrell, uh, Vice Chancellor, Professor Karamjit Singh, um, Dr. Uh, Professor Batra, Dr. Manjit Singh, Dr. Ro Rohit, um, all of you, my heartfelt greetings and to the audience, whole of the audience, my, my greetings, though I can't see all of you, but um, I hope you are, you are listening. So, um, it's a privilege to be speaking about Indian Accounting Association, which has been, um, which has been contributing to academic profession and academic dis uh, accounting discipline in a very, very meaningful way. And since 1970, so that's a very, very long period. So when these mega projects like Indian Accounting Associations start, so there are two easy things that could happen. And one difficult thing, two easy things are you start with such a big association and then you wind it up. And the most difficult and challenging thing is you continue to contribute in a meaningful way year after year and decade after decade. And this is where Indian Accounting Association has contributed, not only in connecting industry practitioners, accounting academics and students, um, so in multiple ways, Indian Accounting Association has contributed, and this is where contribution from leaders, academic thought leaders like uh, Dr. Sorrell comes in. And um, just out of curiosity, I was looking at the model curriculum developed by um, Dr. Sorrell on the Indian Accounting Association website, and I was actually amazed by the variety and the diversity of the topics there. Anything you talk about, you think about uh, teaching here like cryptocurrencies, digital wallets, di digital signatures, platform, digital technologies and platforms. You think about anything and it was there and I was really appreciative of the hard work done by Dr. Sorrell and, and his team, of course. And uh, uh, Indian Accounting Association has been contributing by holding conferences and webinars since of last few decades, which provides opportunity for the accounting academics and practitioners to come and connect with um, academics from all over India and also from foreign universities. And then the journal published by Indian Accounting Association, um, Indian Journal of Accounting gives an opportunity to academics to publish research which is relevant to the geography, relevant to Indian context. So this is where Indian Accounting Association has contributed in a very, very meaningful way. And practitioners could come along, they could, um, they could share their practical concerns and practical problems that they are facing, and then they could seek solutions from academics and thought leaders. So um, multiple ways in which um, we could recognize the importance of Indian Accounting Association. And of course, uh, an association is what its members are and what its branches are. And I'm really happy to hear, you know, just now that uh, Patiala branch has really started to revive and uh, take over this responsibility to take it further. So in terms of accounting education and uh, making students future ready, job ready in Indian context, uh, I think um, Indian Accounting Association is doing a great job in steering accounting education and profession in, in future. So... In terms, of, uh, in terms of research trends, I can highlight two things that came to my mind. There could be many, but two things that I would like to talk about is 
first yes society is changing accounting is not a natural need like we need water and air and food to live but it's a socially constructed need we need accounting businesses can't survive without accounting they will be fish out of water without accounting and this big data analytics that uh, professor manjeet was talking about um, all of these um, accounting has really evolved the way society has evolved to meet the stakeholders needs in multiple ways accounting has come a very long way about 26 27 years back i vividly remember my father was working at that moment in a um, in a local manufacturing firm as an part time accountant and every sunday he he, he will bring two big large cloth bound books at home one was journal one was ledger i was doing my bachelor's in accounting at that moment and i was i was writing helping my father to write and general entries in the journal and then posting them to the ledger i remember those days and now we are talking about erp we are talking about sap oracle and what not and all those digital platforms so accounting has really really evolved in that sense so um it is important that accounting keeps on identifying what society needs and also identify the challenges that will come when we talk about this big analytics and changes and expectations the issues of transparency and ethics are going to kick in no doubt about it and there is research needed in that so research could be from implementation of these big technologies point of view my daughter works in one of the a uh, fifth largest accounting uh, accounting firms she is not an accountant she is data and sci- scientist and she provide consultancy and it's amazing really you know um, she was doing a project in which there was data from one company with five subsidiary and she had f- data from five years and she was just looking at fixed asset register and in fixed asset register there were about 3 million rows in the in that data that she was analyzing 3 million rows just one company five year data points and this is and she doesn't know anything about accounting she is just a data scientist you know so there there needs to be collaboration between what this it people can do with their software like power bi and altrix and all those softwares and what accountants can do and how this information can really talk to each other i think that this is where the problem is so every time she looks at a different excel and different data set she says two data sets sets are not talking to each other so those kind of implementation issues are there and um just very quickly uh, i'll add and the second area is uh, the more human side of accounting which we cannot ignore at all we have un sustainability development goal and we need to look into what different what role accounting can play in achieving measuring those sustainability development goals so my new venture in research is uh, what retail organizations in australia are doing to reduce food waste and what they are doing to achieve sustainability development goal 12 so um, that's another area which which will have real impact and really keep accounting relevant in the society from impact point of view so those were the two major areas i wanted to share from research point of view and india is a large economy and people have research orientation you guys have access to the data and people are very very expert in um in quantitative analysis so this is where you the researchers in india have got the strength and we can write the story if there are there are any opportunity for from anyone listening in the audience um, you know if there are any opportunities where we could collaborate i'm happy to network and i'm happy to provide you further contacts if there might be funding opportunities mentoring opportunities joint collaborative research opportunities i'm happy to serve the profession in any any way you know even if minute whatever i can do i'm more than happy to do so and i i hope people are uh, listening they would have uh, a lot to together from the speakers uh, different speakers um, tonight and i wish everyone all the best for the rest of the webinar thank you thank you ma'am uh, your ma'am your knowledge regarding data science international accounting practices like in australia relevance accounting and this time modern time will definitely help us thank you ma'am Uh, today we have among us a scholar par excellence professor g soral immediate past president 
Indian Accounting Association, former professor, HOD, Dean, faculty chairman of ML Sukhadiya University, Udaipur. Sir has 39 years experience as university faculty, supervised 27 PhD, two postdoctoral and 10 MPhil students. Sir published three books and more than 50 research papers in reputed journals. He is a recipient of International Research Award by Institute of Chartered Accountant of India and also got All India Best Member Award. So, sir, I request Professor Soral to kindly share your views with us. Sir, please. Thank you, Roji. Uh, humbled with the nice words that you have used for me. Uh, in this uh, one-day webinar, uh, my, uh, you know, decade-old friend, Professor Karamji Singh Ji, Vice Chancellor of Jagat Guru, uh, Open University, Punjab, uh, respected G.S. Batra Sahib, whom also I know for decades. And if, uh, I believe I could meet him today only, I could see his face today, perhaps. Uh, we have been talking often many times, and uh, he has been inducted into the university. Uh, I mean, that again, an accolade to Professor Karamji Singh Sahib. Uh, Dr. Manjit Singh, uh, the HOD and Dean here. Uh, Dr. Monica Kansalji, for her brilliant speech, I have listened to her. She's bringing laurels to us uh, while being in Australia. I would also request you something during my speech now, once you have made several offers to us. Uh, Rohit Ji, who has been uh, you know, a very active secretary. Uh, all of you, my hearty greetings on this IA Foundation Day. Uh, as I've already been introduced, uh, I've been a past president of the association. Actually, I'm the immediate past president and uh, a very old life member of the association. I think since 1984, I am the life member. I've been general secretary and uh, Karamji Singh Sab know more about that. Uh, so when uh, Batra Sab approached me uh, for this occasion, uh, I told him that, oh, of course, you are designating me as the keynote speaker. But um, uh, a foreigner, uh, an Indian foreigner is already there to talk in terms of the keynote. Let me talk more on the role of IA. Friends, uh, I am overwhelmed to see that with the concerted effort of Professor Karamji Singh Sahib and of course Professor Batra Sahib and others, now our Patiala branch could revive. A very old branch it is. And uh, uh, I remember during mid-90s, uh, Professor Karamji Singh, perhaps you were there, others are very young <laughs> to quote that year. Uh, I took an initiative of preparing a profile of Indian Accounting Association, the ever first effort I made, and hard copy of that, because those days soft copies used not to be so common. And uh, in that, I think Patiala branch used to be there, and very few members used to be there. Patra Sahib used to be there, and others. Thereafter, things didn't go in the right direction, and now it has come to see the light of the day. I am so very happy. Today in the morning, the headquarter function I was moderating. There also I mentioned about your branch. And uh, as I mentioned to you, Professor Karamji Singh Sahib, that you, with your dynamism and as, as it was mentioned by your colleagues that you are younger to all of them, I do agree with them, the energy, the commitment that you have. I found find that in uh, Punjab, uh, you know, many more branches of IEA will come. Chandigarh will be revived and many things we can directly talk to you if the, anything wrong goes into Punjab actually in regard to IA. So uh, that is really very heartening. Uh, before I go to the role of IA, actually, I was thinking of discussing certain things, particularly from the viewpoint that we are now sitting in the IA uh, Foundation Day function and Patiala branch recently revived with so many energetic uh, uh, hands uh, involved and a good patronage. I would like to talk to Monica ji directly. Uh, Monica ji, uh, you are bringing Lawrence to India. So thank you very much. Uh, such a bright uh, uh, person, uh, your speech says about it. You're all great teachers are sitting here. Of course, I am also elderly to you. But uh, one or two things I would like to mention to you, uh, you being there and have love and affection for your own soil here. In uh, IA, Professor Karamji Singh, perhaps you are aware that last year, an issue came when some Malaysian people uh, who are in, of Indian origin approached us and wanted to establish a chapter of Indian Accounting Association in Malaysia. Mm -hmm. So we discussed that and one more uh, request came from uh, Middle East also. So we discussed and decided that there, our constitution permits it. I mean, if people have faith in Indian Accounting Association, though they are not at the soil, they may join us as members uh, directly uh, right now and they may also have chapters outside. 
plus we may also have collaborative arrangements with such foreigner uh, uh, foreign based members to have good quality uh, you know research uh, conducted through indian accounting association so monika ji i would earnestly request you uh, you have already seen our website you are praising model curriculum i am so happy about it uh, actually very hard work went into uh, contribution is not mine let me not take credit for it i was president of course i took initiative but a three very senior member committee whose names are there in fact they worked hard of course i was also there with them all through initiative was mine that much but contribution was theirs and it's a legendary document professor karamji singh was uh, uh, was we were discussing about it earlier and he has already requested batra sahab to go through it and maybe uh, that the jagatguru nanak dev university is going to implement some part of it very usefully so in any any such manner where you feel that you would like to collaborate with the indian accounting association to help us in any of these things which i have listed down uh, kindly uh, contact us you may also contact me my address is also there and uh, help us uh, that would be a service to the country and the subject friends uh, regarding the role of indian accounting association i have some uh, quite glittering things to mention here particularly because we missed professor karamji singh during the 43rd all india conference because last moment his flight was cancelled and uh, because that way he couldn't be present and i particularly wanted to tell him all these things he is here very much and all my friends in you friends you will be really very happy uh, to know uh, what i said during my inaugural presidential speech Uh, on 18 december in the 43rd conference i am reiterating that that actually i mentioned and i am reiterating that indian accounting association is unique in the entire world for particularly three reasons for which we all must feel elated one we are monika ji this is particularly for you you are our representative there say it far and loud in australia that we are the largest accounting association in the world we uh, that time abhi rohit ji was mentioning the figure rohit ji let me update you december we had 7300 members you could not update the website but there is an icon in the website you can yourself check that singh sir you will be very happy to know at the moment we are 7613 live members in the association that means within 3 months at the pace of 100 live members per month we are rising and lot of Uh, dynamism and uh, optimism our members we are visualizing second thing to make ia unique in the world is we are the only academic association of accountants in the world which has 57 active branches independently working like patiala branch of ia in the country third we have a uh, you know evolved a system to catch the young into accounting that we term as the national accounting talent search we started this competition uh, in fact i moved a proposal myself in 2008 and ia permitted me we initiated in 2008 first competition we organized in 2009 batra sahab and karamji singh sahab have been cooperating with us all through and all those who didn't know it i would like to mention we are the only acad academic body of accountants in the world who is organizing annually without fail for last last the 13 14 years the national accounting talent search competition where the length and breadth of the country students are participating even i would i would uh, uh, you know with a feeling of elation mention that uh, during covid also very serious waves were going on this uh, event didn't fail we have a fixed date first sunday of february we did organize it in 2020 21 22 that first sunday of february is constant we went on online this time results have been declared everything is there you can find all details on the website so friends that way first thing is, which i mention is to all mem honorable members of patiala branch that feel elated that you are a member of iia then talking to the ground realities for a branch because it's more of an in house meeting i would like to mention that now we have facility to uh, obtain membership of iia just by using our mobile phone so maybe that you are traveling and you can join iia 
uh, monica ji this is also for you motivate uh, so many people in australia to join ia okay everything is there on the website online application online payment plus you can also generate your live membership certificate through the website you can generate your ia identity card also through the website with your photograph and everything complete so that convenience now this website is providing rohit ji this is in particular for you you need not uh, wander here and there you see i have also been secretary of my branch 30 years before i know karamjit singh sahab also okay those days have gone you just motivate people tell them this is the indianaccounting.org visit and become a member that will definitely help you few more things i would like to add last year uh, singh sahab is aware about that we had two significant memorandum of our understanding signed with one with european accounting association so now we have a, an mou with eaa here and uh, singh sahab next year uh, i may share this with you that the 29th 30th october conference we are going to receive some senior professor from european accounting association to visit us maybe the president uh, 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 analisa may herself join then we have one more mou with institute of cost accountants of india now about this mou i will take a minute in mentioning to you uh, again for rohit ji in particular because you know the uh, the the working engine of any branch is the secretary dear rohit ji okay all of us are there with you but you have to take initiatives what is there is you may kindly go through this mou this is also on the website institute of cost accountants of india which was arst while icdm there uh, we have already uh, uh, signed an mou both the presidents that now we can have collaborative programs with cost accountant institute in us so through the university through your department through the branch you may organize functions they also have promised singh sahab in particular uh, this is for your consideration and for your stm university consideration that they have uh, uh, you know proposed one youth development program because as we know that the cost accountant institute is a statutory body so government charter is there with them they have already passed that youth development program for which they have offered to iaa under uh, a, an mou that we can give certificates of that youth development program through icti so that may be kindly explored out of your team and your university may kindly take initiative that will be helping the youngsters like anything so that also is there uh, this particular uh, you know opportunity rohit ji we should uh, harness and uh, manjeet singh sahab also as president of uh, this branch then two two suggestions from my side to the branch being an oldie in ia i would like to come forth with. of course one is there at the moment that we have an expert from australia i am from rajasthan and we all all are meeting we may it's so easy now to have online events and uh, batra sahab was mentioning in between uh, just when we started that we are going to have now series of programs so kindly do that and one uh, or more branches in the country are also uh, in the fray of uh, publishing online newsletters online journals of the branch also so journal may be uh, too early to say but maybe an online newsletter you may start you may ask some of your colleague to take charge of it you see online no resources are required but that will strengthen your branch like that uh, finally i would like to say take two more minutes uh, regarding the issue accounting in a global era uh, uh, you know as they say it, it is in digital era I'm sorry uh, monica ji was very beautifully mentioning about certain things here okay she talked about uh, the <clears throat> data analytics uh, manjeet singh sahab was mentioning about how big data is he he mentioned that two years data equal to all the data earlier uh, you know what a burden on accounting we have shifted analysis has no more re remained a word in the field of accounting now it is analytics no comparison monica ji was mentioning very interesting fact actually i noted it down when you said 3 million data points in one balance sheet my goodness it is unimaginable can we not reach our students in talking about these things so karamjit singh sahab i would make an earnest appeal to you and batra sahab and manjeet singh sahab all sitting here 
we must think in terms of uh, organizing some certificate programs or add on courses or capsule programs of one week duration on data analytics through your university that would really be giving a great service and uh, people like monica ji etc are there to assist you it, it has come to our doorsteps now and about sdgs you mentioned yes these days they are using a term like accounting warriors a new term has been coined they say accountants must think about the sustainability which monica ji was very rightly mentioning and i was very happy to see that she is herself having a research interest in that area so that is undoubtedly very useful there is a great need friends here that now we should move the accounting education more towards uh, discussion interpretation less towards calculation we all know that all those who are of my age group here they know that we have been trained in accounting more with calculation we used to keep calculate calculator in our hand those days nowadays uh, tablets and uh, computers but our students have been uh, you know oriented more towards calculations etc a time has come to drag them back towards interpretations and discussions because all these calculations will hold no good now all statistics all quantitative techniques all econometric analysis everything is at the press of button at the moment let us forget about that but the other challenges are very great for us so i think i have taken enough time thank you very much for giving me this great opportunity uh, to talking to all of you on this auspicious day thank you very much thank you sir definitely we will encourage others to join indian accounting association and in future lot more persons will join thank you sir now i request honorable founder vice chancellor professor karamjit singh ji to share presentation remarks professor dr karamji singh ji an excellent scholar researcher and administrator is the founder vice chancellor of jagat guru nanak dev punjab state open university patiala sir has more than 50 publications to his credit in internationally renowned journals and publication houses known for his irrevocable quick decisions knowledge and management skills he was chosen for various high positions like registrar punjab university chandigarh director ugc hrdc center punjab university chandigarh and chaired many committees and boards at the national level he has been awarded nine times by the national agencies he successfully completed two major research projects sponsored by ugc and asian productivity organization tokyo japan we are highly thankful to sir as due to his endeavors only the patiala branch got its office in the premises of the university to carry out its operations and activities sir please thank you dr rohit you see that uh, i i am proud proud to be a part of an association having uh, as per sural just mentioned that more than 7700 roughly members and 57 branches and we have already completed 53 years and uh, i am i am i'm really you know uh, find myself you know that uh, uh, it's a matter of proud moment for us that we are celebrating this day and with us professor soral and of course dr bonika is with us and i am sure that uh, as uh, we have initiated this uh, uh, i mean this branch professor manjeet singh and professor dr rohit they will definitely steer this patiala branch to newer heights now as uh, professor soral mentioned that uh, uh, they have a tie up with the uh, indian cost accountants or something that sir let me say this thing that we are also having a tie up with the with the same organization our university has already initiated and we have already entered into agreement that i am sure that uh, in due course of time we will start certain certificate courses definitely in our university now you see already lot have been said about indian accounting association let me talk something about uh, that uh, what should we do where we right now stand you see that it's a undoubtedly without doubt that we are living in a different environment i just i am reminded of a, a quote by uh, 
World Economic Forum founder, uh, Klaus Schwab. It was founded in 1971. In 1971, he remarked that technology is affecting our lives, reshaping maybe economic, cultural, social, and human environment. And the point which he mentioned about why I am I am referring to him was that uh, he said that it will be a great promise and greater peril also. You so know that we are accounting professional people. We understand that things are changing at a very fast rate. As Dr. Monica referred to her daughter, that she's a data analyst having 3 million rows and data is too much. The idea is that what should we do? So normally what we did that technology is affecting finance and accounting profession in a different manner. You talk about the speed because we have to quickly give a ticket uh, decision and provide the data. Then second point, that technology-based transaction is on the increase because transaction volume it is something which is which is to be kept into mind. Now, the, the mood point is that technology is fine, that whether that technology is adding value or not, whether that technology is helping us in our decision making or not, and probably the analysis which is made by our financial analyst, they will provide that whether you can take quick decisions or not. Then there is a variety, variety of data systems are available, data sources are available. We have to pick and choose that which to, to be used. Then, of course, rightly mentioned by that Monica, that uh, uh, transparency, rather, I would like to term the use the word veracity of the information, whether it's a reliability, it's a quality, it's a truthfulness, it's a prejudice, all this which included into one direction. So this has to be ensured. Now, what should we do? You see, responsibility lies on uh, we, 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 we educationists. Professor Manjeet also mentioned that in the last two years, so much things have happened. You know that there is a need to make our accounting profession. Three things which normally say. One is relevant. Relevant to handle, I mean, present day situations and data available with us. Second is, we have to be very, very strategic. You know, decision has to be taken in a strategic manner. And for all these two things, we need to be innovative or creative because when so much things are available with us, we have to figure out that how to present the thing because ultimately accounting is basically presentation. Accounting is basically uh, providing information to that. Now, what I normally say that we have shifted. Technology gives us what? I mean that he, he defines us. But why it is so, how it will going to happen, that is the, I mean, the task of uh, accountant, task of a people that we have to uh, look into that. What I believe, what I believe that uh, uh, as an educationist, uh, I got an opportunity to head this institution. I am lucky that uh, uh, I am heading a new institution, an open university, new institution. Now, we have some advantage, advantage also that we are not, you know, uh, we don't have any, you know, sort of standard syndicates, other uh, bureaucratic hustles. We take a decision and we quickly implement it. And in a short period of time, I was just sharing with the, the beginning of the session before Professor Manjit came that we had, today only we got a consent from IBM. IBM that they are providing us free of cost uh, because they are charging a huge amount to our students. We have... Uh, uh, tied, up, tied up with the test data and social sciences. What I have in my mind that each department we are mentoring. Coming back to commerce department, the faculty department, uh, department uh, I have already uh, discussed with Professor Sorel. I have already discussed with Professor Khandelwal and Achlapati people, uh, uh, friends are there. They are, we are in touch with each other. We will start. We will definitely start because in our university, one biggest advantage is one biggest advantage is that we can leverage. I mean to say that we can provide very very uh, I mean education at a very very economical cost, very low cost, and then uh, because in open system, what I believe it, it's a university under the name of uh, Jagat Guru Nanak Dev Ji. We are providing a very high quality education 
we, we it is our endeavor maybe initially we may not be that up to level but i am sure that with type type of collaboration which i am having the type of support which i am having from different person we will definitely provide the world class content education particular to the students to so one hand is content other hand is examination in between there is a technology is there right so these are the pillars which i think that for institution which is required and uh, uh, with the people like uh, uh, professor batra rohit and dr manjit singh in patiala itself right i am lucky that we are having a very good team uh, because i depend upon professor manjit also for uh, i mean that uh, accounting field now we are having um, uh, professor monica is available with us dr mahesh is available with us we are in touch with the people from australia and usa also um the other was talking with dr sundar he was also associating with our university in one way we, we will uh, i will try to rope him in in certain uh, because he is expertise in uh, that area also anyhow with the i i am i will not take much time uh, i would only like to say that uh, this is a digital, digital era and lot of opportunities are available lot of promises are there right then if any opportunity comes if we don't catch that opportunity then it is also will be on us definitely we will try that our new generation which will be coming that we can provide a good platform for them to excel in their life and i wish and i am sure that whole fraternity family of indian content association also because this is a forum of indian content association uh, they will definitely support us in our endeavor and other uh, from india also and abroad also with these words once again thanks to sural and monica for coming and sharing thank you very much thanks for such an engaging lecture sir i'm sure your precious insights will enrich us with great ideas to work on this upcoming field thank you sir now at the end i request professor gs batra patron patiala branch of indian accounting association and Dean Academic Affairs, Jagat Guru Nanak Dev, Punjab State Open University, to present vote of thanks to the honorable guests and the audience. Sir, please. Good afternoon, everyone. Honorable Vice Chancellor Professor Karamjit Singh, esteemed Professor G. Swaral, past president of Indian Accounting Association, Professor Manjit Singh, Professor and Head University School of Applied Management, and uh, president of patiala chapter of indian accounting association dr monica kansal working at central queensland university melbourne australia dr rohit kumar secretary compressor of patiala branch chartered accountants attending this webinar the other members of patiala branch of indian accounting association faculty and staff of uh, the university students studying in uh, different centers of university ladies and gentlemen first of all i take this opportunity to congratulate you all on the occasion of the foundation day celebration of indian accounting association organized by the jagat guru nanak dev open university campus and uh, organized by the patiala chapter of indian accounting association this is indeed a profound privilege for me to propose a vote of thanks on this occasion and uh, the idea of organizing this webinar was mooted by honorable vice chancellor we discussed at length the details of the program he gave each and every idea and finally we organized this webinar the theme of the webinar is accounting in the digital era we discussed about the same with the honorable vice chancellor sir and uh, professor manjeet singh he also gave uh, consent to the idea of organizing this webinar on this very important area as professor g swaral has said Indian Accounting Association has played a leading role, a key role in bringing the accounting educator and accounting professional on one single platform. The various issues relating to the financial markets, developments in accounting education, the galaxy of scholars uh, today have discussed the various issues related to the uh, cryptocurrency, the accounting for electronic transfer of funds, and the uh, other emerging areas in the field of uh, accounting education first of all i take this opportunity to express my gratitude to professor g sral former dean and head 
Mohan Lal Sparia University of Udaipur and past president of Indian Accounting Association and uh, by Dr. Monica Kansal from TKU Australia for their scholarly presentation and sparing the valuable time for this webinar. I am extremely grateful to Honorable Vice Chancellor Professor Paramji Singh for giving his idea to organizing this national webinar on the occasion of the Foundation Day of Indian Accounting Association. And uh, the many issues have been discussed. I'm sure that uh, uh, in the maybe in the times to come, so we'll be able to deliberate more and we'll be able to organize a micro level seminar on each of these areas. I'm grateful to the Vice Chancellor for his leadership role. Uh, in the field of accounting education. And uh, he has been actively involved in the more than one capacities uh, towards uh, uplifting the accounting education in the country and is giving dynamic leadership to the Jagat Guru Nanak Dev, uh, Punjab State Open University. We are proud of his achievements. I express my deep sense of gratitude to Dr. Manjeet Singh, uh, who is an eminent scholar in the field of uh, accounting and management and uh, he has uh, activated the branch and uh, under his leadership, I'm sure that uh, with the cooperation of all, so we'll be able to organize more such uh, academic activities on this platform. I'm grateful to my friend, Dr. Mahesh Yoshi, uh, the Vice Chancellor and me, we spoke to Dr. Mahesh Yoshi regarding the same. And he attended uh, one of the uh, meeting which was organized a couple of months back. And uh, when we talked about uh, reviving the Patiala branch of Indian Accounting Association. He has sent his best wishes for this webinar. I'm extremely grateful to him. I'm grateful to uh, Dr. Sanjay Gupta, the leading chartered accountant, Dr. Ashwini Gupta, and uh, there are so many other members from the teaching fraternity of Punjabi University, from constituent colleges, from our learner sports center, and our faculty members of uh, Jagat Bulanan Dev, Punjab State Open University, our staff members, they are all attending this program. And I, I thank them all. And I, pre, I appreciate the efforts of Dr. Rohit, who is part of us as a secretary and treasurer. He is taking a lot of interest. I'm sure that uh, we'll be able to organize many more such events. And at the end, I thank one and all. Jai Thank you, sir. Thanks to you. Dr. Rohit, can I just have 30 seconds to respond to Dr. Soros? Yes, yes ma'am. Yes, ma yes, ma uh, we have um, a lot of time. Kindly continue. Uh, yes, I just need um, 30 seconds or so. Um, whatever you have said, Dr. Soral and uh, Professor Karamjit Singh, uh, I'm really touched by it, touched by the passion you have for accounting. You know, um, being in Australia, kind of, we kind of lost touch to what Indian Accounting Association is doing, but this webinar has provided me this opportunity to establish that connection again. And we, uh, Dr. Sorrell, please be assured that I'll, I'll encourage, I'll, um, I'll speak about Indian Accounting Association, and I'm happy to contribute wherever I can in terms of where my strength is. I believe uh, that the what I can contribute is if at the research design stage, if someone needs any kind of, um, you know, or, or you need some somebody, someone to review some research papers or something like that, they, or you need uh, us to share our research experience or guide students in, in any way, you know, uh, in research or in accounting, I'm more than happy to contribute in whatever little way I can. Um, but really touched by and inspired by your passion and, and, and your energy levels, really. It's hard to see these things here, but I'm really, really, um, I, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling lucky that I did attend this uh, webinar. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Definitely we will be in touch with you in future and we'll take your help. Thank you, ma'am.